Hi everyone and warm welcome to my channel where today uh, we will unbox something from Cartier together. I might have mentioned what it is in the header of this video but <laughs> in case you haven't noticed that that is actually a watch. Uh, before we start uh, my channel is very new and you are very welcome to subscribe. I would really appreciate if you would support uh, my creative splash in the YouTube. But now let's get into it uh, and let's see what I have here. And before we start, I could uh, perhaps share uh, very shortly why I have decided to purchase this particular watch. Uh, so <laughs> it all started with my uh, birthday. I have actually uh, celebrated a very special birthday in November. It's January now, so a couple of months ago. I was uh, of course very glad to receive a lot of uh, wishes, uh, hugs, uh, some surprises. Um, and since that birthday I was really drawn into red color. <laughs> so you, you see I'm wearing a red dress. Before that birthday, for years I, have, I didn't have anything red. But after that birthday I was very drawn into red color. Uh, I have purchased a red dress, the same that I'm wearing today, and which made actually our uh, little boy at home super happy. His, um, less than five years old and he thinks that I look like a firefighter. <laughs> Nevertheless, I was really drawn into red color, red flowers, um, it, and one day after running errands in Stockholm, uh, I was passing by a Cartier boutique and uh, I decided to check out what they have. Um, I was never drawn into their jewelry, to be honest, because Although it has a history and design is clear and quality is great, uh, I just felt that it's just so often that you see someone having, you know, those love bracelets or, or, or other pieces that, well, when I want a jewelry piece, I usually order a custom made piece uh, that has a special meaning for me. So Cartier was never my choice up till now. But uh, nevertheless, I entered the boutique. I must say that entering the shop didn't really feel luxurious. <laughs> Spending even a couple of seconds in a closed um, doorway with a security guy um, felt a bit awkward, although he was really nice. I don't know if in the, um, other countries it's the same, but in uh, Stockholm you have a double doorway. Uh, and uh, when you enter, you need to wait a couple of seconds till one door closes and another <laughs> opens. In any case, I entered the boutique, I said that I didn't book any appointment, uh, this was a spontaneous visit, and uh, I wasn't drawn into any um, piece of jewelry that they ha had in the shop. But then I saw some watches and they were incredible. I mean, they were so delicate, um, more of a bracelet, not uh, a watch. And that is something that I personally was always missing in watches because I, I don't like anything on my wrist that limits my movements and doesn't feel natural. So the absolute majority of watches felt too bulky to me. And these watches from Cartier, uh, I first tried um, French tank and that one I could feel so it was a no. And then I tried the Panther watch and it felt incredible. Uh, it felt like a natural part of my wrist. And then it suddenly felt like this is the one. I haven't bought a watch for, for a decade. Uh, I don't even wear, you know, those Apple watches or anything. I sometimes wear bracelets in silver or gold, but uh, not any watch. So I was like really excited to actually find the watch that I love. Then I explored what versions there are. Uh, I decided that I want the stainless steel version, uh, which is not that soft as uh, yellow gold. I didn't like the two-tone version because uh, I prefer consistency uh, in colors and uh, stainless steel they didn't have in the boutique so I actually had to order it and um, then I decided to have home delivery. So here we have what I received and uh, the order actually came in a big box. I can show it, show it to you. It's really big box like this. Really cool. I will certainly find some good use case for that box. And here is the shopping bag. And then let's start the unboxing together. Keep 
open mine, but this is a real unboxing. I haven't checked out what's inside the box before <laughs> making this video. And that is because I really wanted to enjoy this process slowly because I couldn't purchase this watch uh, in a boutique and have the complete shopping experience. So I, I thought I'll make some coffee. I will take it slow and open this box, enjoying every second of this home experience unboxing. <laughs> Cartier watch. So in, sh in the shopping bag, as you can see, there are all the documents that followed. And uh, here we have the beautiful box with uh, a Cartier logo and it's sealed in a really nice way. Beautiful. So now let's unseal the box. Mm, it's not that easy. <laughs> And let's see what's inside. So here we have the beautiful red box. Look at that. I love it. So let's now open and see what's inside. Okay. And here is a button. So should it open? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, look at that. It's the small version and oh, it's so pretty. It's so gentle. It's so perfect. Look at that. I hope that the camera will manage to focus on it, but yay, here it is. I can't wait to put it on my wrist. Let's do that. Ah, oh, it has a cover. Okay. The bracelet of this watch is something incredible. It's so smooth. It's like a snake skin. I don't know how one can make something that perfect uh, out of the stainless steel. But look at that. Yeah, here it is. And I cannot wait to put it on my wrist. I know that this size will fit me perfectly. Uh, my wrist is 16 and a half centimeters. So it's exactly the size that th these watches are made for. Oh, yeah, look at that. It looks so great next to my wedding band and engagement ring. Look at that. Oh, it's uh, incredible. And the feeling on your wrist is so natural. It, it's not limiting my movements. It's very gentle. It's very feminine. So here it is. Yeah. I haven't received a travel pouch because I have placed the order online, but I have uh, called the boutique and they will send it to me um, as well as the cleaning kit they mentioned. So I am super glad now that I can see this uh, watch on my wrist and uh, let me know in the comments what you think. Does that look as good on video as it feels on my wrist? <laughs> I wonder. And here's a little close up as well. Perfection. So lovely, so elegant. I really love it. Do you? But now I will go and show the watch to my husband. <laughs> While he was also very curious to see what it is. And uh, yeah, it was a really nice experience. Now I can enjoy uh, some of my coffee and the chocolate. By the way, if you are considering a different size, um, well, there is a smaller version called Mini, but honestly, I think it would fit maybe someone who is very, very, very petite or even perhaps a teenager. Um, small version, it looks smaller uh, in real life than in photos, keep that in mind. And medium is, well, I, I think on my wrist, medium would also look good, but uh, I wanted something delicate and more as a bracelet, um, so the small size is perfect. And small size is the original um, um, size for this watch for a woman. So that's just some tips about sizing. I, I feel that for my wrist, 16 and a half centimeter, uh, the, I, I do not have to adjust the band at all. 
so it's perfect i can go and wear it yeah it felt incredible and it will fit so many outfits i see <laughs> Now remaining seals removed and here comes one more close up you can see that the watch has blue arrows and also a blue sapphire spinel here i love it it's so elegant and so gentle and feminine 